Hello and welcome to Tech of the Day. Today we are going to talk about uh, deploying an uh, uh, web app from Visual Studio directly to Azure Cloud. How we can do it? So there is really a simple way of doing it. You can do it like differently. You can uh, do it via uh, deploying it and you can deploy it via pipeline. You can configure your own pipeline and azure devops and you can push your code to that pipeline and that pipeline will automatically deploy your code to your uh, web app but let's say we don't uh, want to go through that process we don't want to do it through pipeline we want to do it directly from our visual studio because my maybe my project is too small or i'm just exploring i don't want to go I don't want to go through this hassle so what what we can do is we can simply uh, create a yeah so this is my my project uh, let's just run it it's simply in nothing but my coming up website which I'm going to deploy so I hope you guys will like it this is for putting my all stuff uh, all the stuff uh, online so this this is how it's gonna look like in the future and uh, here i'm gonna put everything uh, i have and uh, so that i can um, simply you, you can simply if anyone is looking uh, from google they can simply search me and uh, they can find me in here so i'm gonna deploy this website to azure cloud and uh, using visual studio directly from visual studio and uh, i don't have any any so let me just close it and if if i go to if i go to this one i don't have any other resource so these are my all resources i have and uh, you see here i only have one website which is already there running there but i don't have ex an, any other app service except this okay so um, and uh, I didn't create any so what we going to do we going to so I just click here right click on the on your solution so right click and publish so this is simple way of uh, publishing your app service so you see here you have different different options how do you want to publish it you have app service you have app service Linux you have uh, Azure Virtual Machine, you have IIS, which you used to have traditionally as well, and you want to publish it through to a folder. And you can use that later on and put it uh, anywhere uh, on any server and it will be used directly. So what you want to do, we want to do it through app service and we don't have any. So we're going to create a profile. So we're going to create a new profile for it. and so the name by default it took like this <laughs> and uh, it took me my visual studio subscription and it took it, it created a it took the default uh, resource group i have but i'm gonna create a new one because uh, if that, so that i can separate things accordingly so take off the day uh of Tech of the day and uh, hosting plan so you see by default it created a hosting plan which is hosted in central US with s1 blah blah but I don't want that plan I want to use a uh, location as uh, uh, from central and uh, size this is the size you see you see you can also select it here and you also have free you also have shared you have core uh, which is one core 1.75 giga I don't want that you have two cores four cores two cores 3 GB of RAM let's uh, let's take s2 actually 
because it has something in, in there ok I click ok and uh, application inside I can select application inside and but that's okay I don't want uh, for the moment what else I can do is I can create an a storage account if I need I can create a SQL database here and then I can use that SQL database in my website so for the moment I'm not using any database it's simple website and uh, yeah so let's just create it so what we did we created resource group used my subscription and I created a hosting plan so this is app service plan right so you need an app service plan for your to publish your app service or web, web API it's a, it's an uh, web, web app so um, also I in this application I used uh, Google uh, sorry Google API for YouTube data uh, and uh, I used that one uh, I talked about it in my previous video actually but if you want to watch uh, you can uh, check it out um, here we, we see is uh, what I want I don't want this naming thing in here so you see I made a mistake and uh, I cannot change it now this thing will make my life hell actually uh, and let me just see what do I have in here so I should have uh, yeah you see I have new app service plan I have these two new things and uh, they were created today so I'm gonna delete them okay I will do that later on because uh, it will take some time okay so I just click here publish and continue so basically what we did we created we created a resource group we created a uh, service plan app service plan and uh, uh, that means we created a profile with that and uh, you see here the configuration with that become tech of the day dot websites.net with https now it is deploying so now everything will be deployed to this uh, this website and i hope everything works out oops yes so we have our website online perfect oh yeah so you see you have everything here nice and uh, these videos are coming from YouTube and I'm, uh, I'm loading them dynamically so these videos are not static I did not put anything there I loaded them dynamically using Azure uh, using the sorry the Google API and if you want to know how to integrate uh, videos from YouTube to your channel sorry to your website dynamically with the Azure with the YouTube search then please watch my video I will put a link in a link here so that you can watch it uh, later on and uh, I hope you like it so uh, we just deployed a website to Azure and this will be my website so if you want to visit it later on you can uh, you can come here and uh, look at it I will uh, so in the next video we will change the domain name because here you see the domain name is on Azure websites.net which I don't like so in the next video we will change the domain name we will buy a custom domain name and then attach it to this one 
and also we will attach uh, uh, SSL certificates because once you buy the domain name then you need to have SSL certificate if you want to have your website on HTTPS so we will do all that in next videos stay connected and uh, enjoy hope to see you thanks bye have a nice day